Um, let's see. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, that's. A, do you not know that I killed that thing because it was stupid? <laughs> I know I do. Do people who doesn't know what hey everyone is? Oh, that, that was that was a good question, by the way. Bunny, give him a give him a candy. Stand up, Bunny. Okay, so uh, Christmas two years ago, I made a special, and it was just a bullshit thing to troll my fans. I was like, "Hey, everyone, Merry Christmas!" And I was it, and people were like, "Oh, this is amazing, this is hilarious." I'm like, okay, that was my actual call. And then I did it a week later for the New Year's special. And then they're like, "Oh, it's a running gag. It's a repertoire. It's so funny." Uh, it was dumb. Saw your fan base. Uh, they, they, got, they got really, really old. So, then a couple of years later, um, then, like this past Christmas that just happened, um, I, I released it, I released the Christmas special again, and it'll start off with, Hey everyone! Merry Christmas! <laughs> and it broke, because it got old and stupid, and then I made a real Christmas special, a full length, like six minutes. Where you killed Christmas. <laughs> Where I killed Christmas! Where I killed Christmas! <laughs> Why do people cheer for the killing of Christmas? Yeah. Yeah. Go, go to sacrifice so much to save Christmas. Anyway, one of my favorite lines I can think of right now was actually from that Christmas special. It's Alan. And he goes, it's a, towards, the end of the, towards the end of the episode. And he's like, You mother ducks left me out there to die! And now, I'm gonna fuck you up! <laughs> Um, we'll go with Helsing because that's kind of the theme right now. Um, okay. My favorite line? Everything I say! No, I mean, my favorite line? BITCH I EAT PEOPLE! Because <laughs> I do. I really, really do. Uh, my favorite line? Well, in Transformers Bridge, I play Jazz. Who's basically the black character. <laughs> Are we black? And he's still alive? Oh. Actually, oh. Jazz survived. What is he stolen from the other Transformers? He's the only one who survives the damn movie. The black guy survives the Transformers. It's weird. <laughs> but anyway, uh, in episode two, uh, like Optimus Prime gets blown up and rolls down a hill, and he's like, "Oh, what happened? My line is, you got knocked the fuck out." <laughs> 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 Okay, okay. So, for a short time I was doing a Mare Abridged with uh, Zero Master, who does the Mega Man Abridged. And I played Ginta, and also the narrator. And, uh, one of my favorite lines was, Ginta was dreaming, and Jack was listening in. Girls, hey! And Ginta, <laughs> Ginta was saying, Ginta was dreaming about sex, obviously. And it's like, oh, poor Yuki, oh, with the butter and the cream cheese, oh, all over my body. You played Kamina so many times and you chose Ginta? Oh, Mare? Everybody's seen Mare. No, no, you want, you want the. Is Mare your favorite My Little Pony or something? No, my favorite. My favorite comedy line that uh, Take On Gun wrote was something about <laughs> Yowie fan fiction. Like, yeah, you can also that. in Yowie fan fiction, I'll never look at a broomstick the way again. <laughs> that's fucked up. See, that's <laughs> I jerk off to it. <laughs> but then again, who wouldn't? <laughs> Philistines, that's who. <laughs> okay, who has a bunch of a lot of questions? I don't know. You you would like okay I will let you answer the question you 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 are very excited sir. So how often for talking about one one how often was it taking up with the desert bus crew? Oh, take part in desert bus? Yes. It was really sexy. <laughs> Who here knows what he desert bus is? Raise of hands. I was there in the first for the first forty eight hours. It was really awesome. Uh, everyone was incredibly awesome to be around and stuff. The whole place sounds is awesome. Whole place is burning hot, like like one hundred and twenty degrees. That's because you were there. Uh, <laughs> you, uh, roles you want your lap dance for me? Yes. yes. <laughs> 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 that pause happened. Okay. Uh, <laughs> um, but no, it was, it was a lot of fun. I, I hope to go back maybe this year if I luck out. They wish to have me. Alright, um, you pick a question. 
Very big question. Yes. yes. No. I don't agree with the wavy hand. Yes. If you could choose to adopt um, a bridge, a new series, which one would you choose, and which characters do you think you would do? There is a show. It's a manga. This is a guilty for no. <laughs> Little Creeper already wants to do Bible like a bridge except with all the sex scenes removed. <laughs> hey guys, how's it go? What's going on? Next day. Wow, that was crazy. <laughs> Where's that dark room? Wow, what are all these blurs going to end and see? Wow, that was crazy. <laughs> Every segue is, wow, that was crazy. <laughs> Um, there's, there's this, I forget the movie, but it's essentially Love Hina mixed with professional wrestling. <laughs> I'm not kidding. You and need to send me the name of that when you figure it out. I will, because professional wrestlers are the local shopkeepers. Macho Man Randy Savage runs the tea house. Hulk Hogan runs the bath house. And I would want to raise the crap out of it because it's about a guy who loses his memories and lives in a house with a bunch of female wrestlers. And it becomes their practice dummy. I mean, the, the guiltiest of guilty pleasures. If not, it, may, it does make for business. If not, if, I would love to do Outlaw Star. There's one joke that was written by me for another one, which was Who here has seen Outlaw Star? Raise your hands. You all have good taste. You know the scene where Gene has, has having that traumatic flashback to his dad, like, oh, throw you in this escape pod. Don't worry, son, you'll live on. And the door closes, dad dies, right? Our version! <laughs> Don't worry, son, I'll always explode blood splatters and screams. So that the blood slowly squeezes to close. <laughs> That's our version. That's our dark voice. Ah, <laughs> uh, indeed, indeed, indeed. Uh, what would you guys like to abridge? I'd love the gray man to be abridged in a consistent manner. <laughs> Okay, well, first of all, I just actually started um, a new series that I wanted to do, which was, <laughs> it was Blue Exorcist. Oh. I saw it yesterday. Praise the Lord. Yeah. Jesus. Praise the Lord. And you want me to play it? Yeah. Play that clip. Play that clip. Play that clip. Stop, stop, stop. That muffle, that's naughty as hell. Okay. <laughs> Play the clip! Play the clip! Play the clip! Oh, that's terrible. The character that I really love to play in this was, um, Mephisto. In which, what I did with this character was very, very fun. It's great. And I'll see you right now. Fucked up. Let's go! Come on. It's like a really old school 2000. <laughs> blue Exorcist is very, very blue! I sure do hope I can reload my Tropico game. That's a that travel back through time right there, guys. Alright, do we have technical? There we go! Fake for the third! I don't want my game, but fucking Mayor Burton is. It's all in loop. Lights! Thank you so much, B, for the Adorkables who will win tomorrow's Final Fantasy Fight Tournament.